Hello everybody, welcome back to Dead Dreams, where we have what looks like might be a boss fight. I mean, there's health and everything, so very likely. Oh yeah, it's got, there's a lot of health here. Okay, well, let's grab that one, I guess, and uh... Yep. Oh. Okay, those guys I can tap on. Oh, there's my sword. Ow. Okay, so I can light the sword. Oh, maybe I have to light the sword and then hit these guys? Yeah. Okay, there we go. Grab that. Do that. There's probably another one somewhere. Ah! Oh, it like, looked like my mom or something. Uh, there's one. Am I supposed to, like, be hitting it after? I don't think so. Uh, is there one this way? There we go. Okay, that boss fight was a lot easier. <laughs> don't look at that door. No one will come. You're gonna die alone. Choking to death, just as I did. Do you hate me because I left you? Oh, this is my dad, I guess. But really, we are the same. F, yeah. I'm not you. Oh, then why are you hiding instead of telling her the truth? I'll give you a clue. That's the same thing that kept you from reaching Liam after Aaron's death. What? Are you expecting your mother to forget about her beloved son and to simply move on? Sounds familiar, doesn't it? You're hurting people around you because you are a coward. So, as I said, we're the same. I feel like we're less of a coward than my dad, but... Y you know. <laughs> you know. Despite all you did, I still loved you. And I hated myself for that. Because how can you love someone who wounded you for life? But then Dr. White told me that perhaps you did it out of love and self-hatred. And suddenly I saw a person who I can relate to and who I could love. There were bad memories, but also good ones. And I should embrace both. I must give myself and others a second chance. Oh, hey Liam. Like I said, Liam's real good with the sword. Are you okay? Yeah, thanks. No, oh, and Audrey scream. Let's go. <gasps> He's with me now, yay! Uh, I'm gonna grab that just in case I need it. Was there anything else around here? I didn't really look before I started the boss fight. Just clowns and stuff. Also, I feel like Audrey is not who we think she is. I, I, I think she's a bad person, but... Uh, you know, it's fine. Plot and all that. Gotta go save her. Alright, this way I guess. I don't know if it's a good time for this, but I should apologize for my behavior after Aaron's death. Oh, Liam feels bad too. Also, we're back in the subway, I think. It's okay. No, it's not okay, and I, f I feel awful for what I did. I wish I could say that there were some good reasons for that, but... Could you forgive me? Well, you're here now, aren't you? And you saved my life. Uh, again. So I guess... We're even now. Are you sure? It's time to move on. Thank you. Okay, so Aaron did die. Like, 100% got hit by a train. I think... Yeah? I think this place... This whole situation has something to do with Aaron's death. At least, that's what I got from the reports. The reports? Of course. I didn't pay them too much attention last time, but maybe now, with your information, we could figure something out. Okay. A therapy session? What else do you remember? Personalized narratives created by some core? Yeah, some gems or something. Yeah, they were calling it something like j j j j gems <laughs> Basically, they were the game's masters, creating personalized narratives based on the patient's memories. Fourteen years ago, this Dr. Farron caused the explosion and the core... the gems got destroyed? Not all of them. At least not entirely. That's where Amber comes into play. The system is inactive during... The explosion was in... Seven years. Then Amber notices us in the abandoned metro station, and that's where the reports end. So she could be the one who caused the train to malfunction. Killed Aaron. Oh. Is he dead, though? Are you serious? Think about it. Keeping in mind that his body was never found, and that the existence of the digital conscience could be real... Don't get your hopes up. I still don't get what's the point of it all. What's she trying to accomplish? 
Why bother with this therapy? That was a lot of info right there. Wow. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I guess Aaron's dead when we were all exploring the train station. And then we kind of moved on, drifted apart. And that's when we all grew up into adults. And now we're reconnecting separately through, like, AI therapy sessions? And or maybe getting killed by people? Something wrong. Audrey? Audrey! Nope, oh, she just ghosted up those stairs. Where are you going? Liam. Liam, no. Liam, bad, bad time. Bad time, bud. Oh, no, it's train tracks. Oh, no, it's train tracks. It's Audrey, isn't it? She's the one. She's Amber, isn't she? Oh, we're gonna get hit by a train. Audrey? Liam? <laughs> Audrey. Audrey. And there's the train again. I definitely did not run away fast enough from it. And then all of a sudden, wham! Yeah, we've done that before. And I think that's when we went to chapter whatever. Uh, okay. <gasps> no! Thomas! Chapter 4. Oh, that's Audrey and Aaron, maybe? There's no music this time, either. It's very spooky quiet. Spooky. Start integration process, yes. Patient 14, Audrey L, status logging in. Patient 4, Ruby D, status online. Oh, uh, there's me jittering down below there. What's this? You found camera. Press V to take a photo. Uh, okay. I don't know if V's actually... Oh, V is doing stuff. Okay, because it kind of pauses me when I'm there. So I can go in there. Let's go see my jittery body first, though. Hello. Take a photo of that. What's your name? My name is Audrey. Say the secret word. Uh, e a-U-D-R-E-Y, maybe? Right, what's your name? Audrey. Oh, okay, apparently that was not it. Okay. Uh, what's your name? Apparently not Audrey. Maybe it's Amber. Hey, little me's. can't really interact with that. Can I take a photo of it? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's like Hangman. Okay, uh, something something T, something something T. Apparently that's my name now. Yes, Train, I know you've been waiting this entire game for us to come back here, and here we are now. You're welcome. Can I take a photo of you? Oh, now I have an animation when I take photos. Okay. Maybe only when I'm facing up. we got. I wonder if the hacksaw is still around. Or what even the point of that was. Okay. Oh. Mask man? A something T-I-T? -T? 
Oh, uh, uh, bye? Screw you, I guess? Oh, there's the hacksaw. Still there. Okay, apparently don't get too close to those. Just in case. Remember Ruby? Yeah, that's our gem, right? Hello. A R T I S T. Oh, artist. Okay. Her name is Artist. That, that makes sense. I mean, we take photos and stuff. That's a form of art. No, no, please go away. Say the secret word. A R T I S T. All right, and what's your plan? Oh, this is Ruby now. And who's that supposed to be? Azure. Wait a minute. Who are all these people? These are all the gems. It's Agent Smith. Dot dot dot. The one from the Matrix movies? Only that mine is a female version. So you just put on a tie and called it a costume, is that right? Exactly so. Jay, did you choose your costume already? Mm-hmm, not yet. Are we going to a costume party? Oh, well, actually. Yeah? I was I was thinking about making a pair costume, if it's okay with you. Of course, but I already have mine, so... Oh, it's alright. I would love to. Really? Cool. You're really serious about Jacob's annual costume party, huh? <gasps> it's Jacob! I knew he was in here somewhere. Yes, I mean, pretty much everyone goes, so... So what? I'm telling you. It's gonna be boring, as it always was. Alright, what's your plan? Glad you asked. So, how about we skip the party and go explore the caves? There's no way I'm doing that. What, because you're afraid of the dark or something? No, because it's dangerous. Besides, I already made the costume. I'm in. Oh, great. Hey. Okay, let's vote. Anyone else? Jade? I mean, it does sound interesting, but... Come on, you can't be serious. Alright, alright. Calm down, everyone. Listen, let's just first go to the party and then to the caves. For that, we'll need a car. Right. I can take my father's car. Oh, really? Totally. Nice. Okay, so maybe they were like an actual group of kids too before they got made into gem personalities? What? Why are you staring at me? We decided to give it to you in advance so you could get prepared. A secret Santa present? What's that? It's probably a long time before Secret Santa if we're doing costume parties. Just open it. We're super proud of this idea. Okay, let's... Oh. And then the bus crashed. Shock? I mean, it's not gonna do anything. Because the movies are wrong. You have to shock them when they still have a, a bit of a pulse, but... We'll try. Now my choice is just dot dot dot. So did we all die in that bus crash? Or the five gem personalities? Very possible. Interesting that they mentioned the caves though. The school bus has fallen into a river. Uh, because we went to a cave while we were camping at some point too, as the modern kids. Six children drowned. Six. Were there six of us or five? Among them. Azure Rawlings, Calvin Young, Gray Farron, oh it is Farron's son or daughter, Evan Hale, Ruby Walsh, Amber Garrison, Jade McCall, that's seven, um, okay but Azure, no Azure's there, okay Azure, Amber, yeah, Gray, Ruby, Jade, hmm, so they all died. But I thought... So is that why Dr. Farron was doing the gem thing then? To try to get Grey back? Like, keeping Grey alive in consciousness? What do you want from me? Oh, hey. Consider it a little game. You have three hours to save him, so hurry up. Three hours to save who? I'll need three photos and some matches in order to perform the ritual. Can I still take photos? No, I can't still take photos. It's jammed. Oh look, we're in the dirty bathroom again. 
What a surprise. Okay, there's that door, and then there's a slightly less scary door. Okay, we got... Uh, mm hmm I was gonna say those are the Bloody Mary mirrors, aren't they? Uh, hello? Oh, save room. Wait, I didn't get to choose my my save slot there, so is it auto-saving then? I don't like whoever's knock knock knocking though. Thank you. Please stop. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we're at school. I don't want to remember a map. Uh, a bint? Knock knock. Let me in. I feel like Audrey's very tall. Is that just her outfit that makes her look tall? Also, why do I feel like something's trying to chase me around here? Well, I guess we're gonna find out once we loop back here. Okay, so those are all closed. Wait, everything's closed. What? Oh. Oh. oh okay. Can't do anything with that. Ah! Oh, this is open now. What did I just let out? I just let out a monster, didn't I? Yeah, you found photo number one. Oh, Sarah. Oh my God, Audrey, is that you? Sarah, hi. Hello, I'm so glad to see you. How are you? I'm good. You're so worried. You left so suddenly. Yeah, you know, family stuff. Yeah. I heard about it. How's your mother? My mother? She's. Oh my God, she is not. No, no, she feels much better actually. Thank God. She always seems so healthy, energetic, full of life. Must have been hard to keep this secret for yourself in such a long time. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm talking too much. No, it's it's okay. So have you thought about getting back to college? I did. I mean, a family is great, but don't forget about your own life. And you're really talented. Right. I'm serious. Ask anybody. Thank you. Okay, I think this one is mine. Here, it's my new number. Call me, alright? Whoever's moving the desk in the background, could you please stop? All right. Bye. Hope to see you soon. Bye. Mm. I can't move. Uh. Mm. Yeah, whoever is like... Argh. Is it this one? Wait. These get rearranged? Are these slowly just getting rearranged? Mm. Nice. Okay. So I guess we're just going to the classrooms and finding photos? Ooh, bathroom. Great. Lovely. Toilet. Oh, toilet. Toilet number three. Found a photo in the toilet. Oh, hey, it's Liam. Here. Wait, that's a classroom we're just in, isn't it? My photo album. Thank you. It's nothing. The photos. It's just a dumb hobby. I like those, actually. Huh? I love the composition and emotions they convey. You have style. Uh, thank you. Not the most original advice, but forget about those idiots. You shouldn't let them influence you. I know. You think that you're not like everyone else, but you're wrong. For example, James right there. He shoots weird stop-motion Lego movies. <laughs> what a nerd. And Sarah. She secretly attends contemporary dance classes. Sarah would never... You're just making this up. There are no normal people. Everyone has some secret weird passion. Alright. I guess. So... Don't you want to know my dark secret? <laughs> Yeah, sure, Liam. Let's hear it. What is it? Come, I'll show you. Oh. But I wanted to see. Memory or photo number three better show me. Knock, knock. Oh, another door. Um... Oh, I see. Okay, so we can go to the canteen or classroom 1A. I'm guessing classroom 1A has... Stop it. One of these times there's going to be something in there, which is kind of terrifying, honestly, but that's okay. Oh, something here? You found photo number three. Oh my goodness, Laura. Hey Audrey, what's that? Don't. Is that your photo album or something? My uncle's a photographer, and let me tell you, these are trash. Oh, so she got bullied for her photos. Literally. Like, you take photos of trash. Wait, is that- is that me? You took my photo and you even asked for my permission? I'm sorry. 
Are you in love with me or something? You know what? I'm gonna take it. No, give give it back. I mean, the good thing about photography is that if she still has the, what is it, the negatives? She can make more photos. Or what? What are you gonna do? Hey guys, look what I've got. Screw you, Laura. You and Jacob are actual trash. Oh, and there's the matches. Okay, so what's in the canteen then? Also, I don't know what this is about. Oh, this is the other half of the circle though, isn't it? So I might need to come back here. Great. Just what I want. Are you in the fridge? No. Oh, this is where I started from. Uh, where is it? Alright, where's the locker? Because it, it, it locks all the doors until you find whatever it is, so... Eh? Okay, that startled me. That's Laura, though. Hi, Laura. Bye, Laura. Oh my god, she's still chasing me. <laughs> uh, oh, she's still chasing me. No, 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 no. Uh, crap, where was I supposed to take these again? It was up until the right was... er... I thought it was back through here where we started, wasn't it? Oh, I saw her. Heck, I'm gonna get cornered. Um, through here? Yeah, way back here. I never did go through this door. No, it's jammed, okay. Say the secret word. Uh, what? Oh shoot, yeah, I do need the circle. Because the mirror has four points. Maybe it's just Laura. Maybe I can just cheese this right off the bat. Or it's gonna be some random word. It's not Laura. Okay, so bottom five slash four o'clock, nine o'clock, and twelve. Okay, so let's, or sorry, not five, six, twelve, nine, and four slash five. Oh good. Hey Laura. Hey bestie. Bye bestie. At least she doesn't do weird like lurching forward motions. Cause those are the ones that are tricky to avoid where they just like all of a sudden lunge at you. Oh, she's still chasing me? Okay. L. R. A. Wait. It is Laura. Right? Oh god, where is she? Oh, Lyra. That was close. Okay. Leave me alone for half a second. Um, so L-I-R-A. Or some combination of that. Rail? L-I-R-A? Uh, I mean, I probably should have paid attention to where the letters started and ended, but I was just madly trying to avoid Laura. Uh, what else we got? We can do Lari. I didn't do layer. Maybe it's layer. No. Okay. Uh, so I don't know where we're starting. I guess from the sink. So six, twelve, nine, five. Yeah, we're gonna get chased around by Laura again. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. So, start down here. Yeah, six. So L I A. Oh, liar. Duh. <laughs> Should have known that one. Uh, where are 
are you, Laura? Should have guessed that one. The like one word we didn't make out of those letters. You guys can all yell at me now, it's fine. Liar. Uh, matches. I have a gold key still. Interesting. Burn the photos. I guess so. Oh, look, another hell hole. Yay. Hi. 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 Oh, Aaron. Hey. Hey, I just wanted to ask, are there any rules in the club? No rules. Consider it a pressure-free environment. You can make or play games or simply chat with guys. Oh, cool. Because I think he's talking to Thomas, right? Because Thomas is the only one without a nameplate. If you have any questions, I'll be here. Oh yeah, there we are. Do you have a VR headset? Yeah, it's for a game we're working on. A game for VR? Cool, right? Came pretty accessible these last years. I'm doing all the programming and some mapping with Audrey. Neat. So, what is it about? It's about a boy who finds a legendary Oculus chiaroscuro. Uh, like a magic camera used by exorcists to expel spirits and demons from our world. He'll use it to save his friends from a creepy mansion. It's really all about exploring your environment and searching for objects. I see. Sounds great. Well, it's only a concept. I'm still struggling with some pretty heavy bugs. Maybe I could help you out? I can send you all the materials if you want to. Sure. Great. So what's Liam helping with? Hi! What's up? What are you playing? Have you heard about it? No? Really? Well, you should check it out. Hmm, are you doing a research for your game? Uh, not exactly. I don't really make games on my own, and I kind of hate coding. <laughs> Mood. Yeah, it can be tedious, haha. I compose music and create sounds for others instead. Cool. I've never met a real composer. Oh, that's right. Yeah, Liam likes music. And could you help me out with my game, too? If you're busy or anything, just... Uh, sure. No problem. Really? Thank you. Oh, okay, so this is where Thomas meets all his friends. At the video game club. Hi! Hi! Can I ask what you're working on? Of course. It's just a walking simulator, with the ability to take photos. I see. Yeah. Is that the Stillwater Asylum? Oh yeah, I added some places from our town. There's the asylum, Crow's Mansion, the school, the beach area. I was also planning to add a chunk of the old subway system. Oh no. We're in Audrey's game! Cool, I really like the idea. Could you show me some places you made? Oh, I mean, the game isn't ready yet, so... Oh, Alright, I understand. Sorry. No worries. And you? Hmm? Are you working on something? Yes. Mm, it's basically a little village simulator. Have you played... Hmm? Sure. Well, it's gonna be something like that. Every character has his daily routine, but you can also travel between past, present, and future to solve some puzzles. Time traveling, huh? Sounds interesting. It's nothing new or anything. I just like to fill a village with my characters and write absurd quests. <laughs> I'd play that. I love common cozy games. Is it a 2D game? It is. 3D modeling isn't really my thing. Nice. Aaron's working hard. Open the eyes. I'm home. It was just a dream. And saved! Okay! Well, we're actually getting some pretty deep lore in this one. Um, it did a nice little recap of the stuff that we know so far, or that we think we know. Um, and then a little bit more info about how the friends all met. So we all met at a video game club at school. And Audrey does photography. She gets bullied for it. But yeah, I don't know, maybe she isn't Amber or whatever. But we'll have to see. We'll have to keep, carry on, keep going, see what happens. So thank you guys for joining me this week, and we'll see you next time.